Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Are you looking for ways on how to create and set up a Discord channel for your business? Well, you have come to the right place. For in this video, I will show you how to create, set up, and add bots to your Discord server. So without further ado, please do hit that like button and share this video so it could reach more people. And let's get started. Discord servers are free and can be set up easily by anyone that has a Discord account. If you want to use premium features such as optimized sound quality for all chat members, you can also use the paid Discord Nitro service. To set up a free Discord server, here's a step-by-step -step guide. Step 1. Start the Discord app for desktop or smartphone or tablet and log into your Discord account with your login details. Step 2. In the Discord app, click on the plus symbol on the left menu bar to add a server. Step 3. A window will now open. You can choose to join a server or create your own. Click on Create a server. Then choose Create my own. Step 4. First, specify whether the server should be for your friends or for an official club or community. But you can also skip this question. Step 5. The menu for creating your own Discord server will open. Here you can choose your server's name. Once you have entered the name, click on Create. Step 6. Your new Discord server is now ready to use. You can now invite your Discord friends directly. Step 7. If you would like to make changes to your Discord server, right-click on the profile icon of the server in the top left-hand corner. Here you will find options like Invite People or Mute Server. In addition, you can also find the server settings there, as well as the notification and privacy settings. If you take a close look, you will see that Discord has already made a couple of channels and categories for you based on the template you picked earlier. In this example, categories are information, text channels, and voice channels. While regular channels are the announcements and resources channel, categories are typically used to regroup channels that are somehow connected, either through the users that use them or the content that they contain. There are mainly two different types of channels available to choose from, the text channels or voice channels. Step 8. In addition to the channels under General, you can now also create a voice and text channels for different themes on your server. To do this, click on the plus symbol next to the text channels and voice channels. You are free to either put all your channel into one big category or split them into different categories based on a specific topic, for example. Text channels are similar to group chats on other platforms. On the other hand, voice channels are similar to online meeting rooms, such as Zoom or Microsoft Teams calls. You also have video streaming, because voice channels have one additional neat feature, video streaming and screen sharing. Up to 25 users are able to video chat simultaneously, and up to 50 people can watch someone's shared screen. And now that you have created and set up your Discord channel or server, here's how to add bots to your Discord server. Bots are simply computer programs that interact with human beings, and sometimes with other bots, to perform certain functions automatically. A website with a helpful chat window immediately opens up offering to talk with you about your product or service. That's a bot. Adding bots to your Discord server can be a lengthy process for the first time around. Once you get the hang of it, it's actually quite simple. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. Step 1. Turn on Administrator Access. To add bots to your Discord server, you will have to be an administrator of that server. If you don't own the server, it's probably a good idea to check it with the owner before adding anything to it. From your Discord homepage, select the server you'd like to add the bot to. It's on the left-hand side of the Discord website. Once selected, choose the drop-down menu. Next, tap Server Settings. Tap Roles, click on Default Permissions, scroll down to the Advanced Permissions setting and toggle Administrator on. Then click Save Changes. 
Step 2. Get the bots you want. It's important to note that depending on your bots source website, you may see invite or add bots. For this example, we'll use Dino, but the instructions may vary if you're adding another bot. Do keep in mind you will need to perform these steps for each server you own or moderate. First, visit the website of the bot you want to add, then click on the option to log in. Note, each source will have slightly different instructions, but overall, most of them follow steps similar to this. Next, log in using your Discord credentials. Then, select the server where you'd like to use the bot and click Continue. Then, make the selections appropriate for your server and click Authorize. Then, go through the setup process. If you have trouble finding your server, make sure that you're logged into Discord in the same browser you're using the bot's website. Also, verify that you are signed into the correct account. And there you have it. You have successfully created and set up and added bots to your Discord server. I hope you find this video helpful. And if it did, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to keep you updated for more videos. And before this video ends, say goodbye to traffic woes and start driving quality traffic today. Make any business profitable with lower ad costs, higher conversions from Facebook ads. Get leads, buyers, make sales and outperform every competitor in any niche by using Adplify by Technic Force. It's a cloud-based SaaS, newbie-friendly, and 7-in-1 toolset. It's the ultimate traffic suite with Page Watcher, Hidden Audience Finder, Behavioral Targeter, Page Targeter, Email List to Audience, Ad Decorator, and Return of Investment Calculator. So, go ahead and try it out. Just go to get Adplify. Dot in. And that is it for today's video. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.